What's up guys, my name is Chris, or Tainted Catalyst, and today I'm going mid again, and I'm playing Morgana again. Um, basically, she's probably my best mid. Her and Twisted Fate, I do a pretty good job with him. So, uh, yeah, I decided to uh, to do that. Basically, the uh, see the, the last two people, Vayne and Tarek, they uh, pretty much, like, I got in the game and said, Hi, I want to go support, please. And then... I went, how are we all doing? Because I like to be friendly to try and get it going on a good foot. And the vein said, me and Frozen do a bot. And I went, oh, I'm kind of picking first. And they were like, please, we really want to go bot together. He main support, I main AD carry. Usually people don't want support, and so it's usually easy for us to get the lane. And I was like, you know what? I'm feeling like being Mr. Good Guy. I will go mid as... Morgana or Twisted Fate because I was second pick I said do either of you two have Morgana or Twisted Fate and he had Morgana so that's why we ended up swapping I picked Tarek he swapped for the Morgana and because of Tarek uh, the Jax got all in a hissy fit he's Dr. Best Baby but he's not being the best baby right now to be completely honest with you he's being kind of the worst baby you know the ones that cry over nothing so yeah, he want, uh, Vayne wanted to know if she should go as Vayne or as Draven, and I said because he's gone as Tarek, I would go with Vayne, um, because if he is playing as Draven, if the Blitz grabs him when he goes for one of his uh, spinning axes, Tarek can't follow up, really, without going for his flash, but a flash for a Blitz grab, definitely worth it, you know, it's what makes Blitz so absolutely ridiculously strong, so... Uh, Hmm. You know, I think I'm gonna go with that and then two wards. Share in my torment. Getting a little bit extra health at the start. So yeah. Welcome to Summon. Jax is going top versus Rim. So we've got a Riven on the enemy team again and a Vayne on our team again. This has been kind of a uh, a recurring thing. So I'll that's have my interesting. Revenge. Anyway, so I said, if you're going to go as Draven, I would have preferred the other guy to have been Leona for the follow-up, if you needed it. They will suffer. Hopefully Tarek will, uh... Well, I mean... It would have been better if Tarek... And uh, they ended up come up, but people don't do that in these sort of lower things because typically people don't invade. So I'm guessing the jungler is duo with someone else on their team. Not really sure, Without but we need someone really stood there so we can see them coming sooner. I'm gonna stand here just so I can cue them easier if they walk straight down. Now the good thing about this is that they may not, they may have seen us and just backed off because. You know, the scared, how do we how do we do this fight, that sort of thing. Feel my pain. Oh god. Did he smite it? Yeah he did. Alright. Do not dally. So not Perfect. Jax should have really gone B. That would have been better for him. Don't go that way. Don't go that way. Don't go. That way. Don't let him see him. That was what I was worried about. Because if he sees him I'll coming, um, then that'd be bad. So good thing to do against Zareth is to. Uh... Oh no! I tried to click on that thing and it didn't work. Good thing to do against Zareth is to. They will suffer. Not really stand in your minions like I just did then. Oh, what are you doing? These guys could have easily... Well, that would have been a kill on Zareth, then. Without mercy. Oh, well. So, right now, I'm just going to play it safe. If he's using that on me, he's not using it on the minions, which means he's not pushing the wave, which I would prefer, because I do not want this wave to really be too pushed against me. 
I should be able to kill that minion though, yeah. Feel my pain. So, yeah, just going to be farming. Hopefully this one will be a little bit better than the uh, last Morgana gameplay that I had. Do not dally. And hopefully this team will be decent at not dying. So this bot lane pretty much was saying that they're going to scale into late game. They're not going to die. They're very, very good, apparently. Um... Which I'm, we hear all the time, you know, these, these pre-made bot lanes that wind up constantly dying all the time and you're just like, ah, oh, dang it. I'll have my revenge. So I'll get my black shield just to stop for the stuns and uh, who was the jungle? Trundle, so it means I can just walk straight past the pillar as well, so pretty, pretty safe in terms of uh, not dying too much. Oh, I really thought I was going to get that. First blood. So I'm not really trying to poke him too much because he's got the range on me and I'm kind of pushed out and I don't have any vision. So I'm a bit worried about, you know, trying to go in. I also know I can't kill him. Um, and he's got just a bunch of sustain. They will An ally has been slain. So who died then? Jax died, top versus the Riven, not surprised, kind of thought that was going to happen. Um, Do not doubt. Don't know why he... Um... Yeah. Don't know why he picked up Doran's Blade versus the Vayne, he would have been better going off with uh, some sustain. But, oh well, what can you do? Okay. Oh, I think that actually missed. It did. Oh, that was so bad. So bad. I wanted to uh, put it I'll have my out of the but at least now I should be able to get a bit more. I can start shielding myself more. I've said that about, you know, teammates, how I don't shield as often as I probably should. They will um, but you use my shield to protect them. Good thing about. Morgana versus Zareth is that when he roots himself, so long as he doesn't stun me, um, I should be okay to Q him. And he's actually poked himself down quite a bit. If I can get in there, if I can get a, a Q on him, then. Um... Oh. Yeah, if I'd have been able to get a Q on him, then that would have been really good. I think I can kill him. Oh, I didn't have mana for my ultimate. Oh, dang it. Oh, at least I didn't waste my ignite again. Oh, okay, again, for the first time. Oh, that sucks so bad. Feel my pain. See, he doesn't really have any way to, uh, to stop me. Can't, or if I can get my ultimate off, like if I can, he doesn't have his flash up, so, is he still around? No, he's not, unfortunately. I'll have my revenge. So luckily this channel's not really doing much, I'm going to go back, I think I'm going to get, um, well, I always like Zonia's. I don't really want to get this. I don't really need it. So I think for now... I'll get that. Another one of them. Some boots. A ward. And some potions. So I don't really want to get the uh, Seeker's Arm guy because I just don't really need it. I know it, it's good to get me there, but... I'm doing a better job this time, I think, of last hit. And now that my uh, W... 
is higher rank, I'll be able to kill the minions a lot easier, which means I'll be able to get more uh, of the CSs. Feel my pain. Uh, what I need to do is that, there we go. And just attack them down. And there we go. So signal that she that he's missing because uh you know he's missing. And he's looks like he's getting blue. An enemy has been slain. I'll have my revenge has been slain. Yeah, that was really bad. I needed to uh, do a better job with that then. Feel my pain. The enemy has been slain. Unfortunately, Tyrant got it, so that is a shame. But it's not the worst thing. I think if this is our catches me with a stone, I'm probably going to die. However, he seems to be playing quite passively. He's just going for uh, for these minions. Which is good. He's not trying to go for kills. So, because of Morgana's natural sustain with my uh, passive, it's quite easy to uh, stay alive. Feel my pain. I think he kind of needs to go down bottom. I'll have my revenge. I'll kind of alternate a little bit between these two. Uh, I'll have my revenge. Oh, there we go. That was an easy kill. Yeah. <laughs> Zerf dies once. GG. They will suffer. So that went well. That's good. I'm gonna save up. I think for the uh, needlessly large rod, which I should be able to get from these. And I'm gonna go back. Hopefully, my minions won't kill. Yeah, they will. Uh, I was trying to position that so it would uh, get everything. There we go. So that's good. Now I need to go help out the other lands, I think. An ally has been slain. Go back, get my needlessly large rod, and. Yeah, I'm gonna call that good because the other lanes aren't really roaming. And, um. Your turret has been destroyed. That's a good point. Nocturne I'm, isn't used as ulti once. What level is he? He's only just level 6. Yeah, wow, I'm level 10? Jeez. Further ahead than I thought I was. This is definitely a bad more again than the last one. Without Don't know why I went in on that, I don't have anything to follow it up with. So I think what I'm gonna do is just get him pushed in. I'll have my revenge. Do not dally. Uh I wait wait for the attack and then I did it. I shouldn't have done that, that was silly. They will suffer. Ah, uh, the minion walked him away, which is a shame. Shit. Yeah, if you can get the kill on just one of them. Do 
not dally. Ah. The piano died there. Whoa. Wow, okay, I thought he was way over there. That was my bad. Completely terrible map awareness. I thought he was going on there, but he stayed there the whole time. Share in my torment. Well, as long as Tyre can get away. Oh, not really a lot I can do right there. Uh, Enemy killing spree. I'll have my revenge. I think I just saw somebody coming down. Blitz, I think it was. Yeah. So we'll get out. Run away. Play it safe. Don't want to get grabbed and pulled in and killed. So. Feel my pain. We'll go back. We'll get the Seeker's Arm Guard now, just so we're working towards that. And I'll get some more wards and stuff. Just more wards then I guess. I'll have my revenge. So that was my bad. The vein didn't need to die there. Um I made a mistake, made a huge mistake. Which unfortunately got killed, so that's no good. We need to focus on this Raven. She's Possibly going to become a threat, depending on what she builds. Feel my and, uh... Pain. Yeah. Gotta play it safe. Gotta play it real safe. I'm just going to get myself some vision. Uh, just because I don't want to die to a silly gank. Bot lane's missing, so that has me a little concerned. Do not dally. Oh yeah. Ah, uh, I was gonna try and EQ her. Unfortunately, that didn't really work out for me. But oh well. Oh well. Yeah, bot lane was missing. I, I did. Mention it, but then as soon as I saw her get killed, and I was like, I have got to kill him. <laughs> it's a horrible habit, but oh well. I'm gonna go for the death cap next. Just uh, go for this damage. Try and get some. God dang it! An ally has been slain. Yeah, we're past landing now. Like this ribbon's so far ahead that we need to get kills on them as soon as possible. Um, I'll have my revenge. Ah, she's too strong. Oh, too fast for her. Not too strong. I'll have my revenge. Come on, minion, 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 minion. There we go. Alright. Let's go get this. Oh. Hit the, uh... I'm going for the E now. Um, I was going to alternate back and forth between the two, but said E is probably a little bit better. Oh, 
Oops. I wanted to uh, go for an attack there, but I guess we'll have to uh, try and get the kill on the Caitlyn instead. Don't want to die, don't want to die. She's faster than I. Oh, I'm trying to be myself, it didn't work. I used to just jump straight up where Blitz is, is Blitz going to get him? Oh, he's getting away, good. What's this Jack's build? I'm gonna guess he's still going damage. Yeah, he really needed to build a bit of defense against her because right now he is useless. He does nothing for us at all. So, that was a split up fight. We messed around too much with Zareth. Um, Nocturne didn't really need to be there when I was fighting the Zareth. Uh, I think I would kill him on my own. Feel my pain. So that was a shame, but he's got a death cap, so he is actually I'm probably stronger than him just because I've got the new slide rod and that. But um, his burst overall is just ridiculous anyway. So without mercy. How is she full health? Okay. They will suffer. Yeah, right now, because we don't know where anyone is. Although, it looks like we're getting some vision, which is good. Feel my pain. I'm just gonna go see if the blue is up. Do not dally. Nope, no blue. I'll have my revenge. Share in my torment. Time reckon. Oh, we're here to turn around just team a little bit then. That would be really good. They will suck. Oh, that sucks. I'll have my revenge. That's a shame. Well, we got the kill on two of them, and the Riven wasn't even in the fight, so... <clears throat> the thing is, it seems like the Jax is one of those... We have to, everyone, go all in on the Caitlyn, uh, including our Vayne, and that's not the case. I mean, look at the range difference from Caitlyn to Vayne. She massively outreaches... I don't want to wait for that. She massively outreaches the vein. And the vein can't just run through. Um, the, like Trundle and the Blitzcrank. She has to attack the outside forces. And th this Jax is so far behind that... Oh, why did they stop walking? I mean, like, the blitz was right there. No, get away! Why? Why do that? Oh, 
Oh, okay, I'm not sure why I did that. I thought I'd guess I thought I had more health or something. Oh Nocturne, if you can Good job. Okay, that went a lot better. That went a lot better. That was uh more the fight we needed. I didn't even use my ult. So that was a lot better. It looks like the ribbon. May have DC. Oh no, she's up top. Never mind. So she's just gonna split push. So if she wants to keep split pushing, if we just keep fighting them, um, eventually she's gonna have to stop Shame doing that. And by then, we'll hopefully have caught up with it. So I'm gonna go with my blue buff first. Unfortunately, I didn't have my ult. If I had my ult then, uh, that would have been a lot better. Feel my pain. So, I'll get my blue. <coughs> Excuse me, I'll get my blue. And then, uh... Without mercy. I'll have my revenge. Ooh. Do not dally. Good job. That's what we needed. An enemy has been slain. Without mercy. With Jax, we should be able to. If Jax can kill him. Uh, I don't want to waste my ult on him. Right, let's just go for that then, I they guess. Where's Vayne? Vayne died. Yeah, she did. Tarek, take another CS. Wonderful. I'll have my revenge. So, my ult's going to be hitting really hard now. Next, I think I'm going to go for a Void. Um, Do not dally. Yeah, this is this is my number one tip to those people that go, my team never does anything, they just die over and over and blah 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 blue. you got to tell your team to stick together. Just keep telling them. I know it's hard because they won't always do that, but the more you can emphasize it, like, Vayne being down there on her own with no vision is not good for anybody, you know? Feel my pain. So I would rather us get the Baron, just because Baron is something that's not always there you know like these these things are always going to be there. we know we have a stronger fight as long as this ribbon wants to keep trying to split push awesome another thing as well is like if we see ribbon down there a lot of people's first instinct is to go after her because you know kills uh, usually more important to those people, but right now, look, we're four man in this. We, we will push much harder than her. If she comes here, um, like we'll kill her. And if she doesn't, if she keeps pushing, we will. Oh, 
No, why, why stay? Why stay? Why stay? Why stay? Why stay? Give <laughs> up some health. They will suffer. Killing spree. Ah. Well, you know what? That turned around really well. Unfortunately, the uh, vein just died, but that went a lot better than expected. He can kill you, Jax. If he just turns around and does one Q, <laughs> you're gonna die. Oh, that was a lot better. That was the sort of fight we needed. And we were behind already in it, so I feel pretty good about that. When I uh, respawn, I'm gonna go for that. And why? This is why I don't like when people stick around and chase. Like it's so pointless. We just lost Jax and Tarek because of that, all because they couldn't just leave it. That is why they need to just leave. Go with the blue, and then uh, after I get my void, I'm gonna start getting oracles. Without mercy. You gotta, you gotta get out of there. Um, so I'll get the uh, Void Staff and then I'll probably sell one of these to just stack wards because even though I'm only a mid laner, <coughs> it doesn't matter. You know, like, I, you know my stance on wards. Everybody should ward. Oh, you doing? You're crazy. <coughs> that was good. That was good. Right, we have to take this now. I mean, they'll give us such a boost in damage. Ah, oh, dang it, come on. I'll have my revenge. Ah. Oh. Seriously now? Feel my pain. Jeez. Without mercy. Oh, dang. Right, yeah, so, I don't know why that Nocturne went back, we got two kills, and then we got the kill on the Zara, and they're like going, oh, we need the dragon, we need the dragon, like, 190 gold on each person, while, yeah, that's nice, at this stage in the game, it's not as good as they seem to think it is, you know, like, we would have been much better, let's go for that, we just saw them bottom, and we just saw her top, what are they doing? Without mercy. Oh my god. Oh, kind of thought you were going to work on that. I have no mana. Run, run, run. Still like this, like, why? Why turn around and fight? There's no reason to fight. I have no mana. We should have just gone for the tower, like, it would have been so much easier for us to do that. I mean, at least they're chasing us instead of uh, doing something productive. So that's always good. You need to not be there, Vayne.
Go for the void. And then I'm gonna go for an oracles. I know my blue has run out, but I'd rather have this just to uh, be safe. I'll have my revenge. We just let him have free tower. Here. Come on, Bane! Come on! Oh my god. Do not doubt it has been destroyed. Oh, I was really confused then, because it said that <laughs> she was on a rampage. I was like, how is she on a rampage? Didn't make any sense. Time to try and flash Q him. Ah, hold on. Feel my pain. They will suffer. I'm putting on him because he stood in front of all of us, so if he tries to grab, it's just gonna hit him and do nothing. Feel my pain. Your team has destroyed an inhibitor. Huh. The reason for that shield then was because the uh I want the assist. It's 5v3! Oh, come on, guys. <laughs> this is a huge part of, of losses at low relo, is bad objective control. Like, we could have easily killed them again. Now, we're just taking pointless damage on the tower. Like, I don't know what the plan is here now. Oh, keep tanking it, keep tanking it! Oh, no, turn. <laughs> Jeez. That didn't match him down, so. Oh well. GG. And, uh, yeah. Yes, report team for Blitz fail. You are noob vein. I'll just sort of jazz. <laughs> <laughs> well, we won. I'm happy about that. I feel like I actually played quite well in that game. They're much better than the other non-support roles that I've done. So, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Just take note, if you've watched all the way through and you're playing the low and you're like, why do I keep losing so often, even when I do well? Like, if we'd have lost that game, I, I could have been in that same, you know, mental state. Like, I played so well. I feel like I did very well. I was trying to push the objectives. None of my team were listening to me. Yeah, you just have to keep pushing and mentioning it to them and just telling, like, we should be doing this, we should be doing that. Don't don't take the initiative and do it yourself. Because as you saw with the Baron, I took way too much damage and nobody followed up on it until I... I would have been dead, you know, by the time they got there, so... Yeah, try and um, try and just keep pushing for the objectives. Tell them we need to do this tower, we need to do that. If they all go to one tower, don't stand and try and do one on your own because you'll die and then you'll be like, Oh, my noob team ran away. Just go with them. Um, you're always better as five. If you just stay as five people and push one lane... Uh, after you've you know done your laning phase, as long as everyone didn't feed horribly, you you can still win quite easily. You just try and get everyone to stay as five people. That's the easiest way to win games because people get split up so often. That Riven was constantly on her own. Now we could have wasted time trying to chase after her, but thankfully my team didn't. That's a huge no-no. When someone's split pushing, engage on the other team. That's the that's how you beat split pushing. Engage on the rest of them because it stops the person split pushing. And if they don't, if they don't stop put, split pushing. You have to keep pushing. So win the 4v5. 
the Riven, for example, in that game, she wants to keep pushing, fine, we'll take three towers by the time you take one. So that's what you got to keep in mind. You've got to do that. Try and win the, the 4v5s and then don't chase after the one person, especially someone like Riven. Because you've got to look this way. The most common split pushes are the people that are harder to kill and harder to get to. So Nidalee, Shen, uh, Riven, you know, they have these ways of escaping that you don't have the ways to keep up. So anyway, that was a bit of a ramble at the end there about that sort of strategy but thank you very much for watching i hope that you enjoyed it if you did leave me a like rating and subscribe if you want to see more i haven't said that one in a while so i will see you tomorrow goodbye